given them a chance of defending that against the Warriors, but they did live from Abu Dhabi. Are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Tails is the call. Tails is the call. What do we got, Roche? It's heads. It's heads. Stay in here, don't go anywhere, and you're going to bowl first. Hello and welcome back once again to the Sheikh Zayed Stadium. The Deccan Gladiators prepare to take on Team Abu Dhabi. The Gladiators have won the toss and elected to field first. One change for them. Mason Crane is in for the injured Zahir Khan. He went off with a rather nasty looking dislocated shoulder or suspected. Won their uh, last three games. It's the Bangor Tigers. T10 in here in Abu Dhabi. Men in yellow, on the other hand, have uh, run into a bit of a brick wall. They tied their first match a strike. Fresh from his... Uh... Bang! Able to get underneath it, a length ball. How many times have we said this today, Danny Morrison? Length. Smoking! A lovely start for Vishka. Kabushka. Through. Oh dear. Make that. Four fours in the over. Andre Russ. Oh, he's knocked him over. Forward arm man. He is so, so good. So, so experienced. Magical. There, yeah, the Google goes on. Have another go at that hook shot. Oh, he's nailed it this time. Found the gap, Moen Ali. Short again. Now that's what I'm talking about from Moen Ali. Just hardly swings at it. Will that get the gap? It sure will. Mr. Pollard doesn't like diving normally. Form, really. Lovely. Now that, what I liked about that shot there was he, he hit it and the ball knuckled off, off the bat. He didn't hit it with a lot of top spin. Golf ball from the great drivers. Lovely shot. Oh, he has banged this. And he's knocked him over. That one seemed to stay in the pitch forever. Luke Wright got through the shot. He's not really looked at. It's just the normal leg, leg break there. And it, it's the slow one. Gave you no pace. He got you right. It got stuck in the pitch and actually hit the. Cutting. He's disappeared here. He's up on the bank. Thanks. Madsen. Face the pace. Flag the spin, brother. That is sweet. Gone wide, I like it. And so often, Danny. Run away for another one. Through his arm, didn't it? Into his shoulder. Speaking of shoulders, he's given us some shoulder over the keeper's head. It happens a lot now with the slight dislocations. We know Chris Slim, but the, the field needs to improve that. That's the next question. Sived away from the lovely little boundary here, so they're getting a bit of a rattle on here. Ben Cutting's been hurt. So is it here in terms of uh, the entourage, haven't they? You've got you've got fitness trainers and you've got fielding specialist coaches. Mm, the conditioning guy. That is brilliant. That is real clever. It's gone all the way for the maximum. Alubon A2698, you name it. Oh! Now that might be bias. Shazad, mate, what happened? Is it a leg by? No, it's bias. Shazad, the keeper who's normally amazing behind the stumps. Catches the call, Danny. Catches the call and it's out. Oh, Ben Cutting. Nice to have you aboard. It's going away, the wrong end. He's had to drag it back to the onside as it's spun a little bit away from him. Went for 17, but got the wicket of the skipper. It was quite bizarre how that ball went into his hand there, because normally his hand was in front of the right. Now, did he hit this out of the ballpark? Yeah, I reckon he has. That, that's a long way. 
That's, that's, that's a good 75 metre hit. Well played. That's not bad. And over to go. And can this be another biggie? Up, up and away. But not far enough. Should be taken. Is taken by the... And Madsen just played beautifully here. He really has. He's missed out here, of course. But 29 on 14. Strike rate 207. He's done his job. Brilliant knock by him. And there it is. Signature move that all the kids around the world love. And finish. Yes! Looks useful, looks useful. Oh, more than useful. That is a stunning strike. Straight enough, hard enough. There he is. Pollard can't get there, so this is turning out to be very useful. 115, they've, yeah, they've breached 110. Oh, that's a wide, that's a wide. There's pace there. What about the footwork there by Shazad going down leg side? Got around there pretty easily, got to that ball that would most people would have found difficult to get. By Shane Watson. It's uh, not paying rent, get rid of it. <laughs> 20 from nine was uh, Lewis Gregory. Well, useful knocks there, 23 from Luke Wright. And uh, Wayne Madsen with that 29, pretty good. Yeah, it was a good batting performance at the end where they looked like they were just going to get 100, 105. Let's have a look at the bowling. Cottrell got hurt a little bit. Ah, the forward was brilliant. Two for seven and none for 15. For 15. Okay, Karishma, who have you got down there for us? Well, you'll need a partner. Should have is struggling to come out of the dressing room yet. Don't know where he is. There he is there. Well done. They're keen, these two. They're both power players as we welcome in. Mark Butcher and Danny Morris. Contrasting styles, but look at that strike rate. Quite obscene, really. Let's give it some humpty, he says early. Mark Butcher. Mustafa to open proceedings. And Mohammed Shazad goes bang. Mohammed Shazad. Oh dear. Mustafa. Not there, buddy. Not there. We'll go uh, over the upside this time. One bounce and four. Richard Lockwood working and moving and grooving here. And Sharj, I think, was. Bosh, boom, bang, he's done it again. Shazad. Shazad is looking for anything that he can get a, a horizontal bat at. Short guy. The shorter guys you want to get the ball. As... Goes again. And that's going to be four more. This bowling going around. He's wanted to try and whistle us past the grill, but it's not happening. Mamba Dabi scorecard. Oh, he's knocked him over. Mustafa gets his man. Oh, don't worry about the Spice Girls. The Spice Boys. There he is. What? A, that's a dreadful stroke. He's not happy about it. And then he has a crack back. Important to both these teams, the Gladiators, they're flying, they've done all right. They're at the top. I reckon they're already there. They're qualified for me with six points. They only get six games each team. So 62 will be their target, 61 for a tie. And I've got a feeling, though, even if it's a tie, that's not going to help them get through. And he... For the next 15 or 16 deliveries. Team Abu Dhabi on the bottom with that uh, poor net run rate. Just a win and a tie to uh, their name. So it was anybody's guess as to who would have prevailed had they played the, the five over game. Just about within, in with a squeak of uh, getting into the top four to get into the playoffs at the weekend.